guys, what's going on? This is Fishman200 here, and my usual first-person shooter games haven't really been uh, satisfying me recently, so <clears throat> I went through the Steam store and I found some games, put them on my wish list that I thought would be interesting that I haven't really heard anything about. This is one of them, it's called Dev Guy. Um, it's about a game developer who, I think, loses his game info or something the night before it's going to release and he needs to find a way to get it all back or something. So, click here to start. Let's get going. Hope you guys enjoy. So that must be me. Hello, and welcome to the life of a dev guy. The man you see in front of you is Warren. He's the dev guy you will be controlling. Cool. All you need to do is help him upload his game into the App Store. Unfortunately, Warren's computer crapped out and lost his data. Luckily, Warren has a backup on a jump drive in his car. You just need to get him to it and upload the game. You control Warren's movement with arrow keys and use the E to interact with objects. When Warren attains a new item, it will be assigned to the R key and will appear where the red arrow is. Got it? If you ever wish to quit the game at any time, just hit escape and go to the main menu. Fair warning, this game does not save. You have been warned. Oh god, that's not good. Good luck helping Warren get his data back, and most of all, have fun. Cool. Alright, so arrow keys are moved. Oh, I can use WASD too. That's good. Hmm, bed. Let's not go to the bed. Uh, this is my desk. Not much to say about it. Past it being my desk. Cool. I take it this guy just smokes constantly. This is my desk, once again. It's a TV. It doesn't work, though. Why do I even have this thing? Alright. Uh, looks like some books. Hmm. It's my bed. I sleep on it when I'm not putting another, pulling another all-nighter. That sounds somewhat familiar. It's my bed. Okay. Let's go to the door. Door. God, the door feels jams. Pushing it does nothing. I'll have to go around. Hmm. Then, eh, maybe if I can unscrew the supports, I can sneak to the other side. Hmm. Ooh. It's a bookcase full of books on dystopic sci-fi novels. Like... Batshit Max and Best World something. Oh sweet, it's my trusty flathead. <laughs> I can't leave the office without this little guy. Of course. So now, now I have it, right? I have the, uh... <coughs> ah, there we go. <coughs> well, cool. That's how it works. Oh shoot, I guess it was the pull door the whole time. Oh well, now it's open. That's interesting. I don't even know how my own door is open. Six, five. Oh, I must be in an apartment. Caution tape. Let's try to go into uh, this person's... Nope, okay. Can't go in that person's apartment. Looks like a crime scene for Miss Lonely Heart's dead cat. <laughs> I'll have to find a way around. Oh my goodness. Poor cat. Now I can probably go through the door. Yeah. Now I'm in somebody else's apartment. Don't mind me, just passing through. Disappointing. I was really looking forward to judging that game. Computer that I can't use. TV that I can't use. Someone else's bed that I can't use. Let's try this door. Oh, bookshelf. All these books are blank. Maybe they're here just to make the place look busy? Huh. That's interesting. Why would, uh... Oh, It's Viobaka's female body pillow girl, Natasha. Why am I even looking at this? <laughs> That's a good question. Ah, a door. There we go. Hmm. There's the crime scene. Now we're on the other side. Through the stairs, let's go down there. Mm -mm -mm. Another apartment that I probably can't go in. Oh, maybe I can. Let's see what's this way first. Ooh, a pony. Let's go look to pony. 
I call plagiarism on that. I don't even like ponies. Hey, maybe I like ponies. All these apartments. Alright, going outside. What? Drat, your car just got towed. <laughs> You'll have to find a phone to call the towing agency. Take it, I can't go in this door. Can't cross the street. Crossing streets is dangerous. Can't go that way. Hmm. Alright, let's explore. Could you imagine if we made that noise to talk? To walk? To talk. Oh! I'm in the street. This is dangerous. What if I get hit by a car? Alright, let's go back inside. Find a phone in here in one of these apartments. Because everybody just leaves their... Whoa. Leaves their door open. What's... Ah, there's a phone. What's with all these game things? I do not envy the poor, poor soul that has to sleep on this thing. Oh, it's just a little mat on the floor. Okay. These cartridges are blank. This must be for homebrew games. I remember these consoles. I always remember breaking mine. Ah, no, nah, I never broke my Nintendo system. Phone. Cabe's towing. This is Cabe. Cabe, it's Warren. One of your guys just towed my car. Oh, shoot, really? Yeah, really. Alright, let's see if we have it. What kind of car is it? It's a black Buick Electra. Oh, shoot. What? What's wrong? I just got back from telling a black Buick Electra. Damn it, Cabe! What the fuck? What? Your license plate said, tow me. So I just did what it asked. <laughs> That's not an excuse for towing it. Oh my goodness, the jokes. <laughs> I suppose you're right. Sorry about that, man. Sorry, just bring it back. Alrighty, I'll be down in a bit. <sighs> Sounds like Cave just pulled up. Wow, that was really fast. The towing company must be like right across the street. Oh, why don't I check the other apartments while I'm here? Before I go back out into the, uh, out into the code. The door's locked. My one weakness. <laughs> I'll have to get in another way. The poster that apparently I don't like. Ah. Oh. It's a weird room. Why are all these rooms weird? All these beds look the same. This complex must, must not really value the people who live in it. Maybe. I don't know. Everybody else has a computer. Everybody's got the same bed and the computer. Alright. Now we're outside. Where's my car? Ah, there it is. Damn it, Cabe! Wow, you shut up fast. That's what I said. Well, my place is just two blocks down. I told you! It was like right across the street. That would have been convenient if you didn't tow my car in the first place. Oh, hey, that reminds me. I saw you left your car unlocked, so I locked it up for you. Oh, is that so? Yeah, man, I got your back on this stuff, bro. I appreciate your concern, but that means I gotta go upstairs and get my car keys now. Because I wasn't carrying them. Oh, I'm sorry about that, man. Alright, I'll be right back. Hmm, interesting. How was I expecting to drive? I can see the pony lover's room through this window. There's also a pony on the floor. How was I expecting to drive my car if I didn't have the keys? <sighs> it's gonna be a long walk. <clears throat> oh shit, a sound came from outside. Better check it out. But I just walked inside! Go! Did he tow my car again? Oh! Okay, why is my car window busted? Well, I felt bad about locking your car, so I broke the window and unlocked it for you. <laughs> Seriously, Cabe? What the fuck? Hey, man, I made up for my mistake by opening up the car for you. I just saved you a trip, bro. You broke my fucking window! Uh, well, um, sorry. It doesn't matter anymore. Now that it's unlocked, I can finally get my jump drive out. Oh, you mean this thing? Why didn't you say so? I had it with me the whole time. Damn it, Gabe! What the fuck? <laughs> I really don't like this guy, do I? Well, I figured no one would be using it after I towed the car, so I took it for myself. I'm sorry. Just give me back my jump drive and we'll put this behind us. Alright, well, I'll be headed back now. Good luck with that game, man. Sorry about taking your car. Again. 
Thought I got my jump drive. I think it's time to upload this game and move on with life. <clears throat> After a series of annoyances, and finally, have your hard-earned backup on hand. And that is the life of a dev guy. Simple, a little rough in some parts, but genuinely... Wait a minute. This jump drive is empty. Dump dump bam! Alright, I think that's going to be it for this video, guys. Um, let me know in the comments if you want to see more. Um, it's been an interesting ride. Some of the jokes are a little corny, but, I mean, that's kind of my sense of humor anyway. So, I think I might keep playing. Um, since apparently it doesn't save, I don't want to have to play through this again. Um, I'll record it and whatever. But just let me know if you guys want to see more. Um, I had a pretty good time playing it. It's entertaining. Um, so yeah, thanks for stopping by. This is Fishman200, swimming away.